yeah, I forgot about that. Um, hmm. I want my... You know what? I think I'm okay with that. I think that's a good crew. They've done a... I mean, other than yellows, we're gonna find out on that one. There are so many types of Pikmin. You ain't seen nothing yet, buddy. Where am I? Wait, wait. Oh, I came back out the way... I... I, oh, I went in. I wasn't... So that's a new cave. I didn't expect that. There's bulb orbs over there. Alright. Um... Let's get that pocket watch first and foremost. Oh, no. We're getting the... We're getting that. That's what we're getting first. I guess, actually... Yeah, we're, no. I, I, I know what I'm doing. I know what I'm doing. I've played this game before. Why did I say that? I haven't played this game before. <laughs> I don't know where they came from. But yeah, I was talking about um, quality of life updates or uh, changes. Okay, come back, come back, come back, come back. You get that along with um, two. And then I grab this. <coughs> Pikmin is... I cannot get that. All right, I'm going to need a different kind of Pikmin. What kind of Pikmin might I need? Who could say for sure? The longer something takes, uh, it, it's it's not just a matter of time and difficulty because there's more chances for you to mess up if something takes longer, but it's also a matter of time management. Is it worth doing? The answer might be no. In the case of that, that mini boss yesterday, the answer might be, ah, do something else instead. And that's where Pikmin really shines is it's time management. Now, other Pikmin games have gone back and forth on instituting a time limit. Pikmin two or Pikmin one had honestly a pretty for a, a, a kid and even as an adult who doesn't quite know what they're doing on a first playthrough, it had a pretty rough time limit. Um, there were points where you'd get far enough, uh, inter you'd, you'd progress far enough that it was impossible to beat the game because you hadn't gotten enough treasure. Or en enough ship parts. And... Ooh. This is probably gonna be trivial. Hello. Flint beetle! Or glint beetle, sorry. More? More? Oh, that's it. Alright. That's about as much as I expected. For a second, I thought that was a massive pile of spark of uh, gl the sparkly and glitter stuff, but it's just an area to stealth in. Um, but yeah, Pikmin three had a time limit. Pikmin, um, where am I going? Like, actually, I want to push that bag down. There's a something here. Oh, right up here, right up here. Pikmin three had a time limit. I'm really dancing around topics. Pikmin one had a time limit. Um, Pikmin two did not. And I, honestly, I never, I don't, I never thought it needed one. It was difficult without having a time limit. Uh, it was difficult in other ways with the advent of caves. We can take, we can take out ten more Pikmin now. This should speed up our search. And this game so far does not have a time limit, but they found ways to to flex difficulty in other ways. And obviously, we still have a day limit to to work with here. Uh, I would like to go back. Actually, you know what? No, I don't want to go back. Um, unfortunately, one, two. I kind of want to freeze. Oh, wait, dog, 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 get over here. Doggo! Come here. Get that. Thank you. Goodbye. I would like to go this way because there's another cave and yeah, I want to summon, I want to summon my base. In fact, oh, this is perfect. Dog, dog, come here. Yep, pull it the other way. I, I would like to go over and deal with uh, that weird figure that we saw, but I also have other priorities. 30. I will not be able to do that for a while, and I don't I don't really want to... I don't know if my dog can swim. Okay, you guys, get that. Get the plastic. And I want to work towards that. I guess I can just jump up there. Oh, I can just jump up there. Oh, this is easy. Uh, let's... We have enough time in the day. I want to I wanna stress test the, the time limit. Can we go into a cave as we go into the red, and will we come out at night? We're gonna find out. We're gonna find out today. Uh... You... Steve, get back here. Oh, for a second, 
for a brief moment, my heart dropped because I was able to sprout Pikmin and I haven't lost any. Uh, I thought for a second I might have lost some off screen. That's gonna be how I lose Pikmin. I need to be mindful of that. Ooh, this is pretty. And this is kind of a new area. A baseball, a cave entrance. I don't think I want to go in here. You know what? Ah. Yeah, I really, I really want to go over there. There's a cave over here, but man, if we haven't seen that multiple times, I said I was going to tackle it today, and honestly, while yellow Pikmin were really cool to get, I want to take this on. Now that we, we can take out 40 Pikmin, I think I'm ready. 40 Pikmin, 20 yellow, or 20 blue reds, 10 yellows, 10 ice, and a dog. Come on, we have a dog. What can possibly go wrong? I think nothing. Nothing can go wrong. And that's why we're going to be tackling whatever that is. If we can, we might not be able to, honestly. We're going to find out. Oh, that's buttons. Do I stress test swimming yet? 20? I don't have 20. Hmm. Okay. We're going to try it. We're going to try swimming. Does it work? Uh... Nope, it doesn't. Nope. Everyone's drowning. He cannot swim. Why did I do this? This better not be how I lose Pikmin. This is bad. Ochi can't swim. Press B to call him back to shore with your whistle. This was really dumb and we get a double cutscene. It's going to kill everyone. It's going to kill everyone. No. Hurry, a Pikmin is drowning, you idiot. Why did you just walk into water? Get out of here. Get out of the water. Anyway, <laughs> we're gonna move on. That will have to wait. Hmm, that looks suspicious. In fact, it might even look tasty, but we can't get over there yet. We don't have enough ice Pikmin. So maybe, maybe, just cause I, I kinda wanna stress test my abilities to go into a cave towards the end of day. Maybe we go into that the, the first cave, not the new new cave we saw, but the one right there. That uh, seems like a good way to quote unquote end the day by prolonging it. Get on the dog. And then we're gonna, yeah, let's go into a cave. We can get couple, the balls and the strawberry, but honestly, I wanna see what happens. Industrial maze. The ground, it started moving. I groped for a way forward, but I couldn't make any progress on my own. I wonder if Moss may be able to help me out of this mess. Oh boy. <laughs> this looks kind of terrifying. But at the same time... I think we're ready for the challenge. Wait, what do you mean? Oh, I, I, I see, I see, I see. Okay. That's the suggested? I think I might go with that. Yeah, we're gonna we're going to go with the suggested. I could be taking Ice Pikmin. Let, let's go with our gut. Industrial Maze. Sublevel 1. Why do I think the game's difficulty is about to spike? For some re uh oh. I think the bad feeling I have might be justified. Oh no, this isn't supposed to happen. Ochi's all the way over there. Captain, what's the protocol for a situation like this? You and Ochi need to find a rendezvous point, Jeff. Open your actions and use the left stick to select switch to explore as Ochi. Aha, I was wondering when they would teach me this. And now there is also, I think, a go here. I can't even see the bottom of this cave or anything, really. I'm just kind of listening to what you have to say. Switch. I hope that wasn't there the entire time and I'm just blind. The dog is playable. The dog can whistle? The dog's a captain? I wish I had a face cam right now because I'm kind of blown away by this. 
This is crazy. Can I pluck Pikmin? No, I can't pluck Pikmin. I can do this. And which reversed the the flow, I guess. I don't I'm going to I'm going to switch back. I think that's what we need to do. This gives me a little bit of hope that if this cave is about teaching us a new mechanic, it probably won't be that difficult, but I I don't know. There's something about this locale, the industrial locale, probably because of Pikmin 2 that makes me scared. It makes me scared, man. Some of the worst moments I had in that Let's Play in the Pikmin 2 LP was in the industrial area. X's jump. Oh, I can rush against the other walkway. Um... You know what? Let's... Yeah. Let's do this. I'm not going to whistle the dog just yet. I kind of wish that we were allowed to name the dog. Because it's not like this game is voice acted, right? What reason would we have to not be able to name the dog? That's the wrong way. Or wrong button. Switch the dog. I'm mainly switching... I, I didn't whistle the dog because I am i don't know how to, like, dismiss the dog. Oh, that's really cute. I'm sorry, buddy. It's also weird to me that there are this many button presses for, uh, for switching. It's, it's like... You know, I have to hold a button and then do this. Uh, it, it's, a, it's a little bit weird compared to other Pikmin games where they just had, like, a hold menu you could do. Uh, sure. Do that. Do that. What? Wait, whoa, whoa. What are they doing? What are they... What? <laughs> that... Come on. Can you guys all do it, please? I really want to see this. Come on. Oh, that was so cute. I love that. That might have made me like the dog more than I have. I can throw a Pikmin. All right, so the dog is a captain. You know, for a long time. Yep, that's what I thought. For a long time, people wondered why captains couldn't help with certain tasks. Because obviously, Olimar has arms, right? Why can't he help? And they fixed that by <laughs> giving Olimar and the captains in general a dog that they could use to complete these tasks. Which is kind of funny that the captains still don't do anything, but a dog is now a captain. Can I lower these? Uh... I don't know if- I feel like I should be able to lower that. Oh, whoops. There's a lot going on here that I... I kind of messed up on. Um... Yeah, let's- let's swarm that, too. And I- Yeah, thank you, dog. Come on. There. Charge? a lot going on. Don't charge off the cliff, pal. Do not do that. Throw. And then everybody should be able to get on their way, right? Yes? Uh-huh. Kind of correct. Okay, we gotta wait. What are they doing? Oh, they're waiting to get back. Man, this is a crazy, crazy cave. And I know this mechanic's only just getting started, because this is gonna reverse, and then they're going to walk here. So I have to kind of, like... I'm kind of like the puppet master right now. I just gotta let them do their thing. Which, I guess, it, if I wanted, want them to do their thing... Should make it a little bit easier. Are they going right through that? Oh my word. This, uh, this cave, this cave's kind of blown my mind. I know this was a mechanic in Pikmin 3 in one of the challenge levels, but to see it in the main game, and to see it done so, like, crazily, I don't know, this is like a, a puzzle. I like it. I, I'm so glad I didn't throw him off. That would have been... Oh my word, I would have lost my mind.
the final sub-level. We've been in, what, three caves? Four so far? And we have yet to encounter a boss. And I'm wondering if that streak is going to end here. Because with that streak ending, I have a feeling so too will our no death streak. Let's use our drone. Conveyor belts down there. I'm, I'm glad to see that these caves feel... They, they feel like Pikmin 3. Or Pikmin 2, sorry. They feel like Pikmin 2. I wish they had... A little bit more noticeable music, but they do have some music, and I'll settle for that. Another base, a train. I'm not seeing any bosses. That's scary. I don't like that. Alright, this seems like a fairly docile cave. Now, how do we go about... Well, first off, it, we're probably doing this. Probably running this. A ducky! Why do we need reds? That's a, that's a good question. Why why have they given us reds? Uh, let's make use of this. Um, Y, command... How do I use the go here mechanic? H ask your pup to sniff out yellow Pikmin, or just Pikmin in general? Odd. Okay. So we can... We can make use of this mechanic to sniff out a bunch of stuff, which I need to be doing. Otherwise, I can have him go to base. And he will. And then I can switch to him, but can I use the go here mechanic? I can. Okay, so this game is about to open up. Now that I've figured out how to switch between... Uh, between captains, which I don't know if I already had that ability, but now I 100%, you know, I know I have it. This is scary. Um, we're gonna jump down. Now that I know I have this, the game has opened up. We have two captains. I can effectively multitask now and not feel like I'm playing Pikmin 1. So that's what we're gonna do. Uh, I'm able to send my Pikmin back to the base and have and have Ochi grab them. I'm able to go across this, and at that point, once I do that, you know what? I'm gonna leave some Pikmin over there. Whoa, 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 are you kidding me? That's a tussle? Don't scare me like that game. It's a honey wisp. Honey wisps can't do anything. Look at her. She's beautiful. She literally is just trying to bring nectar to her children. Don't scare me like that game. Or spray. That's sweet. That's kind of nice. Oh, Lord, game. Don't... Don't ever do that again. If there's a tussle, there has to be some tussling involved. If there ain't no tussling involved, then I don't see the point of it. It's just a honey whisk. That all carries sprays. That's kind of insane. I'm probably gonna save sprays for, uh, for... <laughs> tussles? You know, against enemies game? Uh, I can go through this. I really... You know what? We're gonna do this. Uh, switch. Give him some yellow Pikmin. And more. There you go. And then, we're gonna stick here. Switch. He's going to whistle them all. And we now have yellow Pikmin. Look at us multitasking. They're waiting to get through. So let's, let's help them with that. They're riding me, which means I can't use the charge mechanic. And while they do that, hopefully they don't get into a tussle. I <laughs> Humans forbid that they get into a tussle with a, a non-hostile enemy. That would be that would be awful. We have the exit point. We have some Pikmin. We're gonna rush this, which I think I have just enough. And if not, can I put Ochi on it? Can Ochi help? 
He can. And then I switch back. Look at this. Look what's happening here. So Ochi can't use the charge mechanic. How do I get through? Um. It's a very val. Oh, wait, wait. No, Ochi. Ochi, Ochi can. Ochi can. And Ochi. <sighs> Cancel. Good. They, they will continue to do nothing. Um, I will whistle them all. Throw them on that. Look at this. Look at this teamwork. Look at how well I'm handling this. It's almost like I've played this game or played this series like 400 times. It's great. Charge this. Ow. That kind of hurt my body. Can, I, can uh, Ochi call this back? He can't. Oh, wait, no, he can. Yes. Move the base. You know what? I think I was scared of this this ca this castle, this cavern for nothing. I think I need to have a little bit of faith in my own skills. Don't, don't, may that comment not age poorly when the Dandori stuff happens later. Because I, I see it. I saw him. I saw him earlier today on the other side of that that moat, and I'm kind of scared. But for now, I'm, I'm handling myself. All right, let's check that ID. Look who we have here. Dingo, also known as Ralph. An officer who is, excels at solo missions. He's not a, jo a joiner by nature, but he'll show up and lend his physical abilities when need be. <laughs> I knew it. I knew he was tough enough to make it. Dingo is a skilled ranger, even though he doesn't use a rescue pup. He specializes in solo missions, you Bye. see. One thing's for certain. For certain. Rescue missions should be a lot easier with his help. He is basically a dog. The most elite form of life in the world. You track down our ranger, Dingo. The only rescue officers still out there are the doctor and the pilot. And... Let me assure you, the doctor tasted delectable. All right. I would say, I think there's some raw materials left, so I, I'm not going to say that, yeah, there are a couple left. Uh, you. Actually, wait, 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 you. Wait, 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 wait. Uh. Yeah, you guys get on that. Dog, I was gonna use to go here, but eh, whatever. Look at us. Uh oh. Oh, ha! Um. Well, that's awkward. You know what? Let's let's do a little bit. Of, let's practice some Dandori here, cause I'm all about that Dandori. Go here. Look at this. Look at all the Dandori that's happening here. Cause while. Jeff, who was originally our joke captain, and, um, what I didn't mean for him to be the actual name of my character, but, uh, whatever, I guess it, that's, it's Jeff, it's Jeff now. While he's, while Jeff's going to the base, and then switching the base's location, the dog is practicing Dandori, and his massive Dandori brain is Dandoring it up at the cave exit. So all we gotta do, yeah, look at that, look at that. We, we've done everything. We're actually basically just gods in physical form. Look at the Dandori here that's being displayed. I, I can just instantly leave with my Dandori. Industrial maze, rescues, bingo, pup drive up. Considering the amount of upgrades that we have to get, there are a lot of captains for us to rescue, and so far, I think it's been one in every single cave we've gone in. It's, yeah, there are a lot of there are a lot of captains, or a lot of um um st stragglers, stranded castaways, castaways, Tr detectives, truth see seeker, unlimited locomotive, stately rubber cutie, personal injury plank. The F board and memory fragment top right. Investigation complete. 
cave cleared. And at what point, if you remember, we went in here towards the end of the day. At what point will we come out? It's in the evening. We can take out some Pikmin. Oh, for a second I was very confused. I'm I'm paranoid. I'm pa really paranoid right now that I lost a Pikmin off screen. Explore 50% of the area. Look at us. Uh, strawberry. Certainly they can get that back in time. Come on, help him. Help him. Go. At least get it closer. Yeah, they'll, they'll get it closer. Oh, wait, wait. Come on, guys. Come on. Nope. Look at us! Look at us and our Dandori! We're so so Dandorical right now. We got two caves done in one day, mind you. Two castaways rescued, a new type of Pikmin discovered, and what's more? We got in touch with our inner and outer Dandori. I'm impressed. Uh, well, uh, you know what? No, I'm not impressed. I am whelmed, because that result is what I expect out of myself, myself who have played pa Pikmin 2 to well over the 600 day mark. Pikmin 1 more times than I care to mention, Pikmin 3 like three or four times, and has done challenge modes in all many, many times. This is an expected result for me, and so far I have not lost a single Pikmin. And my head is starting to get a little bit large. I'm not gonna lie. If we're gonna restore the SS cafeteria's radar and expand our search area, we need you to go out and gather more money. Don't forget, that's all we care about. This will expand our range and help us pick up distant SOS signals. Let's give it a spin. Literally, it spins. Do you get it? Almost done. Huzzah, we've detected multiple SOS signals. I hope this gets us closer to finding our missing officers and Captain Olimar. Make a record of that area right away, Colin. I did. It's what I do. I spin, and when I do, I find things. I find people, I find food. And none of those things are different things. They're all the same. Things, food, and captains. I am truly a jack of all trades. That's a lot of treasure. It's still going. <laughs> Look at us. We went from 900 to 20, almost 2200. Great day. Great day. And it's only gonna get better as my Dandori continues to level up. Whoa. Well, Captain, we did it. We finally found our ranger, Dingo. He shares many passions with me. I can't believe I had to be saved by the newbie. I'm losing my edge. <laughs> We're just glad to see you back in safe and sound, Dingo. Are you hurt at all? Ooh. Oh, um, not at all, Captain. <laughs> I'm just, uh, touched that you care. Hmm, this table does not seem to be structurally sound. It's missing screws. Get rock. But Science Guy could stand to worry a little more. Um, uh... Well, it reminds me, Captain. I have some information regarding our pilot. And the plot. Which is what I... Well, accidentally almost said. Oh. Really? Do you know his whereabouts? Great work, D Dingo. D-I-N-G-O. Dingo is your name-o. What? Er, no, no. That's not exactly... Oh. You must be exhausted from all that forced sleep you had. Let's go over the details tomorrow. Go get some more sleep. I am forcing you to get more sleep. No, Paul. Huh? Oh, um, 
You got it, Captain. She cares about my physical state. That means she cares. Honey. Oh, before you hit the hay, be sure to review all the details related to our rescue mission so you're fully prepared. Is that really necessary? Um, uh, Colin, what you handed me was a recipe, Colin. Um, did you mean to hand me a recipe? Also, this... Why is the picture of our pilot on the recipe, Colin? That's really weird, Colin, that you do that. Colin. Um, Colin. Why am I in here, Colin? What have you done, Colin? What did you do to our captain, Colin? <laughs> See you guys tomorrow. <laughs>